good. Oh, jeez. Good evening, everybody. Welcome in, welcome in. <clears throat> Stop that. Oh, this controller's butt. Gonna walk down the aisle on the main theme you swear that would be awesome. <clears throat> that would be ideal. How you doing, W. Roberts? Hi, welcome in. Turn that down a little bit. Hey, Harry, what's up, buddy? How you doing there? <coughs> All right. How's everybody doing tonight? His job is to make a book. Oh, we have guests? Good, good. Hanging in there? Thank you for the likes, y'all. Oh, God. I didn't want to read all this. How you guys doing? Welcome on in. Welcome to... Oh, my gosh. Leave me alone. That's right. I think we got to go to the Cosmo Candle. Cosmo Canyon, baby. You know it. You'll have the Delta. Dude, I hope you don't, Hair. I hope that you don't. Elliot Money, thank you for the follow. Cosmo Canyon. This is where the avalanche was born. I promise my guys someday when we save the planet for Shinra, we'd all go to Cosmo Canyon to celebrate. What other games are broadcast? Um, I speedrun Celeste and Mega Man X. Uh, so far here on TikTok, this is the first game I've broadcast. It's Final Fantasy VII. Uh, anything retro, really, though. I love fighting games, JRPGs. No, we just got started Slingshot. <clears throat> We're heading to Gina Talk yet, but we know. X Potion for that bad boy. Dude, Celeste is so good. If you like platformers, Celeste is like one of the best modern platformers that exists. That and Dead Cells. Dead Cells is a really great game. Right now, I really don't know. But I know one thing. If there's anything I can do to save the planet or the people living on it, then I'm going to do it. I don't care if it's for justice or revenge or whatever. I don't care. Let them decide for themselves. So we're in Cosmo Canyon. We just got out of... Um, gold saucer. X potion heals all health. So it heals 100% health. Phoenix down brings back to life. So either would work. Ugh, this is working. Hey, how you guys doing tonight? Welcome in. Good to see y'all. Absolutely. This is my favorite game of all time. And I'm doing a no materia run. So we are going, we are going at it hard. Hi, Cicero. I wonder how many years it's been. See, gosh, brings back memories. I learned a lot. The Otis taught me many things about the Cetra and the Promised Land. That's right, Corsair. No materia. We've gotten this far with zero materia. Not even the Chocobo lore. I'm alone. I'm all alone now. But I'm... We're here for you, right? I know, I know. But I'm the only Cetra. You want to make some babies? And make more Cetra? Sad thing is, this isn't the craziest run I've ever done. The craziest run I ever did was play the entire game without ever looking at it. Spiky boy. Bonfires are funny, aren't they? They make you remember all sorts of things. You know, Spiky boy, five years ago... It's nothing. Yes, I played the game without looking at it. It took me over a year. <laughs> My uh, Discord chat... Yep, Discord chat... We have, a, we have a great Discord community, and my friends talked me through it. Although, I pretty much handled a lot of the battles. Once they once I got the order of the characters, I knew what to do. 
I'm pretty good at doing the menus of this game without looking at them. I am playing on a PS2. Original P original uh, CD copy on the PS2. On this big ass Sony tube TV. Don't need to see this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Part where Kate Seth dies. The most impressive thing you've heard. It was pretty wild. The final fight with Sephiroth is on um, my YouTube channel. At least there's some highlights, and Tifa almost screwed everything up. It was funny as shit. Of course, he left Mother for dead. When the GI tribe attacked, he ran off by himself, leaving Mother and the people of the canyon. Magic's never been my thing. I think that's why I'm actually doing decent at this. I agree, best game ever, hands down. Come, Nanaki, there's something you should see. Dot, 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 question mark. The place may be dangerous. Will you and one other person come with us? I still haven't figured out a good Master Roshi voice. So... <sighs> I don't want to take Aerith because you know what's coming and I don't want to waste precious experience points leveling her up. But her limp break heals, but it doesn't heal for much. So let's go. I don't know. Do we go DPS or do we go speed? I like the remake. Pride and join the. I haven't. I have. I have only played through the remake once. I really like it though. I think we should take Barrett, just because his big shot is very strong, and he's probably the closest. Well, you know what? Tifa's is probably the closest to um, getting her next limit break. So yeah, as you can see, we have no materia. We're doing this thing. I do need to equip everybody, though. I got... Good old cause. You got it. Hey, J-Ray. Welcome in. I love it. It's so pretty. The, the remake was just gorgeous. Oh, shit. Yo, Requiem, and thank you for the follow. We gotta get... All right. I gotta put Barrett in the party. Briefly. Alright, now we're gonna get Tifa back. We're kinda doing a little bit of uh, item juggling here. <clears throat> Noodle! Welcome back in! How you guys doing tonight? How are you all? It's good to see you, as always. Alright, he needs a silver armlet. He's got his better thing. I think we still have some Molotovs left. No? Oh yeah, we do. Okay. I'm doing great, Kitty Paws. I'm doing great. FF7, you got it. We're doing a no materia run. Absolutely no materia. Lots of items. Alright, now that we sat through all that bullshit, we're gonna save again. On the very likely chance that I'm going to die. How's the game volume? Is it a little loud? It's good? Okay I, okay, I can turn it back up. I can turn it back up. This isn't like Twitch where I can, you know, like, look at OBS and be like, Oh yes, I'm exactly that loud, and the game is exactly this loud. This is just my phone sitting on a camera mount. <laughs> it ain't the prettiest setup, but it friggin' works. Best RPG, absolutely, Dr. Dad. I'd go as far to say the best game ever made. Only level 19? What do you mean, only level 19? I'm so over-leveled right now. It works well. 
I wish... I wish I'd be allowed to, um... Lock the focus on it. But... We're dealing with TikTok here. All right, come in, come in. Hey. Oh, hey, aren't you going with us, Grandpa? You'd be like 25 or something. Like really? I've never beaten Chrono Trigger. Still love this game. Me too, Arrow Rain. Oh, man. I have Chrono Trigger on the PS1 as well. I need to play it. In fact, I have Chrono Trigger on my phone, too. The best music. I mean, this whole game is great music. Yo, Matt's Money Moves, welcome back, buddy. How you doing? Nice. Playing Chrono Trigger, watching FF7. I need to play it. Maybe we'll do that after this. Maybe I will finally go through and beat Chrono Trigger. Stumpy and CDV, thank you for the follows. All right. I never played Chrono Cross. Whole Hog, thank you for the follow. How far are we now? We just got to the GI cave in uh, Cosmo Canyon. Yes, multiple endings. Shit, can I do damage to these guys? Yes, I can. Yeah, you're going to find that I generally go... No, not... So, the big, uh, the big event in the game... The big event in the game is the halfway point to me. You, ever, you got you got bored. I hate mean, for everybody. Yo, thank you for the follow, user 576904397. I didn't get enemy skill, but I'm not using any materia. Zero materia, including enemy skill. Was it Chrono Cross somewhere where the characters get all mixed up too? It's very tedious gameplay. But that's what I like about it. And the, yeah, end of the first disc is when it, that's like the halfway point for me. I think that's about like. Yeah, materia is your magic spells and all of your like other things. Pink and green, great menu colors. We met, we matched them to the lights in the room. Hey, Hitman One, welcome in. Yo, Danny was a bit TV. Welcome back. Wait, didn't I just do her limit break? Yo, Harry Brown, thank you for the follow. Welcome in, guys. Shit. Well, at least they both hit. Welcome in, everybody. Suikoden? I've never played Suikoden. Hey, thank you for the roses, whole hog. For the rose. Big cut across, caught you at the right time. That's how this game was for me. Like, watch gaming streams, relaxing. I'll try to be relaxing. I'll try to... Calm you with my soothing voice. Trogdor! The Burninator is here. I say this is still... I, I still... I like the remake, but I think this is still better. It don't get better than the OG with me. Trogdor, thank you for the ball. Yeah, definitely. I think, I think once I beat this with the no material run, I'm going to do Chrono Trigger finally. Give it the give it the play it deserves. Sir, will you please die? Is Cloud stopped? Yo, thank you for sharing the video. This is still no material, Golden Quinn. See, I think the new story is pretty good. I think what they're doing with it is they're writing it in a way that the story is aware that it happens. A Roman Materia? That's regular. We are on disc one. We just got to Cosmo Canyon for the first time. Jack is Cag. Thank you for the follow. 
Yep, I did not use a chocobo. I did not get Yuffie either. Yuffie, Yuffie, whatever her name is. Annoying ninja chick. Yo, thank you the fire kitty killed it. Welcome in, everybody. Thanks for all the shares, the likes, the love. This is just your time. I appreciate y'all being here. Thank you for the follow, Black Bishop. So many standard attacks. You have questions about the remake? Yo, Mr. M. Palix, thank you for the follow. Bobby Ryan, thank you for the follow. What questions do you have about the remake? You just want upgraded versions? I mean, I, I understand why people wanted that. Not for me, though. I like the new one. I like... See, I don't want to play the same game again. I want to be surprised by a good, fresh story. A fresh take on a, an old story. But obviously everyone's going to want different things. You're not going to make everybody happy. I am playing on a PS2 with an original PS1 disc. Via component cables to this 36-inch Sony Trinitron. Mr. Impelix, thank you for the fire. Thank you for the fire! Fire! Alright, so this shit here, if you, walk, if you run across... You got on PS4? Nice. I think, and that's why I tell anybody that wants to play Remake, play this first. Still craving Remake of Final Fantasy IX? I agree. Fire! Uh, they haven't got far enough for Chocobo Racing yet. They only got to the end of Midgar. Chocobo Racing comes way after that. A bit after that. I can't say way after. Well, these things are just going to be a bitch. I have played Legend of Dragoon. I actually recently beat that for the first time. That's an amazing game. Loved it. It was a good game. Yep, Phoenix down on the boss. You got it. We're by the way, those are just coming in. We are doing no materia. All items and attacks. We are selling material as soon as we get it. We can't even make money off of it. Yeah. Is, is Legend, Legend of Dragoons on the digital PS3 marketplace, right? Honestly, if you like the series, I'd say play it and try it. I don't know if I'd get a PS5, though. You can play it on PS4, the original remake. Yeah, this is roughly my 21st run through this game. I've played this game many times. Tell you what, Legend of, Dra Legend of Dragoon was a one-off RPG by Sony. Came out around the same time as Final Fantasy IX. And it's a fantastic game. I recommend anybody play it. The fighting mechanics in it are really cool. No, Xbox doesn't have it yet. You'd think by now they would have released it on Xbox. It was called the Final Fantasy Kill at the time of launch. It did not do that. Final Fantasy IX buried that game. FF9 buried that game so bad. Yo, Black Caillou Taku, thank you for the follow, I think. Is it Caillou Taku? Caillou Taku? Not Taku, Taku. 
Dude, Wild Arms, there's a shout. Wild Arms 1 and 2 are freaking amazing games that no one ever talks about. Be those next Xbox One a few months ago? Nice. Dude, Wild Arms was a freaking bitchin' game. We are going to die here. Guardians Crusade? I do not. Black Kali Otaku. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Black Kali Otaku. There we go. FF10? FF10's not a bad game. It's not a great game, though. In my opinion. I was not a fan of the voice acting. I think it really took away... No, no, I like 9 better. This is my favorite Final Fantasy by far. This is my favorite game of all time. I never get sick of playing this game. No, we just got to... Uh, the weapons aren't even out yet. We just got to the GI cave in, in Cosmo Canyon. Just after the Gold Saucer. Alright, it's time to start healing. Oh, that's bad. More and more! Hey, narrator, what's up? Speak, my friend. Good to see you here. Did you guys know that items don't heal as much outside of battle? Fun fact. But we're not doing enemy skill materia. Oh yeah, I've played the new remake. Lloyd! Wrong RPG. Yeah, we're doing no materia. Volume died, must use your headphones. That's weird. I loved the remake. Personally, my opinion, it was fantastic. A lot of people didn't, though. FF10-2 did... I, I, I'm not gonna lie, Final Fantasy X-2 is um, not even remotely on my list of games that I <laughs> enjoy. <laughs> the game's rough. It's Final Fantasy, but like, fan service edition. I agree, Jesse. Best game ever. Or playing it without materia. Uh, it's had a couple tough points. Um, the end of the Shinra. End of the Shinra building was rough. Um, tactics on the Xbox, that would be cool. I know you can get tactics on PS3 and maybe PS4 as well. But I know you have Xbox. Tactics is a really good game. Yeah, the No Material Runs had its challenges. You pretty much replace material with items that do damage. Be back in 1999 on PS1? That's fair. I've beaten this game like 20 times. <laughs> I've pretty much played through it at least once a year since I first played it. What do M-Tentacles do? Miss the old FF7? Well, here it is right here. For your viewing pleasure. Final Fantasy VII, no material, Ryan. Black Megaphone. Never gonna use that. Kate Sith's kind of worthless in this run. The Sand Guy. We haven't got that far yet. That's, that's a ways down the road. As you can see, this cave leads to the back of Cosmo Canyon. It was unfortunate that the GI were larger than us. If they attacked through here, we would have stood a chance. Uh, Ruby Weapon. Ruby Weapon's the guy in the sand. Emerald Weapon's the one underwater. Ultimate weapon is the one that flies around and gives you Cloud Sword. Sapphire weapon is the name of the one that gets his head blown off at Junin. 
diamond weapon's the one that comes out of the sea near the end of the game. Greg. All kinds of Greg. Damn, that did a lot of damage. Yo, Derek G, thank you for the follow. John Cram? You want to call boss you? I'm sorry. The boss fight coming up, we can use a phoenix down and kill him in one hit. To be fair, last time I changed the screen color was because somebody donated a bunch of roses. <laughs> they wanted it to just be pink, but we went pink and green. Alright. But it matches my lights. Um, where are we? What, what's happening? Okay, we're over there. Burgundy and black. CRX337, thank you for the follow. Does seem to be fair? Fair enough. No material bonkers, absolutely. want all these extra items. They're kind of pointless to me. Is it this one? Yeah. There is a monster in Nibelheim that takes more damage from magic. He's optional, though. Yep. That's pretty much what we've been doing is, uh... Oh, no, what? Dude! Oh, this controller! What the shit? That's great, Cloud. Oh, and Red 13. Yeah, Vincent. Yo, Benny, yes, very classic. Thank you. Batteries. No, the, the sticks on this thing just are really finicky sometimes. Oh, shit. I'm playing on PS2, actually. Hey, take it easy, Mr. M. Pelix. Thank you for hanging out. Yeah, but her, her, th honestly, her, her cure doesn't do very much damage. Holy shit. Oh, God. Gonna get fucking murdered by a spider. Yo, Jesse Settle, thank you for the fire! Oh, I see what you're saying. Zissa, thank you for the follow. I see what you're saying, Bobby. We're just gonna... We're, we're just kinda winging it here. That's <clears throat> what we do. Yeah, well, and that's what we're doing. We're pretty much using our money for restorative items and better weapons. Aerith's not a must. Especially in disc two, right? Dude, these things have a shit ton of health and they ugly. Yes! Okay, that one died a little easier.
Pretty much. A lot of help for a skinny spider, right? I could have taken him out with a newspaper. I think we'll be alright here. This warrior went through the cave all alone, fighting attackers one after another. Thank you for the likes, Josh versus Jago. Grandpa, that warrior. Ho ho ho! We're almost there! Okay. Let's see if we can do this. I hate this boss fight. So much. What is this? Grandpa is he. After death, the ghost of the GI likes stagnant air. This can be. You ain't tough. Yeah, sad moment coming. Very sad times. Oh no! We Phoenix downed him to death. Oh yeah. Never get rid of this game. I have this game on so many platforms. Thank you, Spiky Boy. Because of you, we were survived. I just did it. <laughs> I just did it. Nanaka, you've grown strong, too. Oh, yeah? Now I know that it wasn't a mistake bringing you here. Come. I have something I want to show you right over here. It's my apparatus. <laughs> Yay, more materia. Yeah, it doesn't always hit when you Phoenix down him. But man, when it does. I'd watch this quicker than a chick bouncing up and down. Dude, just don't ask me to show you how to jump. You don't want to see any of this bouncing around. I forgot how to jump. The warrior who fought against the GI. He kept them from taking even one step into Cosmo Canyon. I appreciate it, guys. Thank you for being here. I'm all about spreading the love of retro gaming. But he was never able to return to town. A phoenix down for the boss. Yep. Yep, you got it. He was never able to return to town. Look, Nanaki, look at your father, the warrior, Seto. Head up a 40. Hey, no problem, man. No problem. I generally try to go low level, but I'm doing low level and, well, I mean, not low level, but normal level and no materia. Yes, I, I got what you're saying, Bobby. <laughs> I got what you're saying. Seto continued to fight the GI tribe here to protect this canyon. Even after the GI's poisonous arrows turned his body to stone. You know what's really fucked up about this? You'll see in a second. Even after they all ran away, Seto continued to protect us. And he even continues to protect us even now. Even now? that he was a coward ran away, but he alone risked his life but to protect Cosmo Kane. Twisted Logic, Horror Life, thank you for the follow. <clears throat> his dad's not dead. His dad's not dead. That's your father, Seto. That, that is Seto? Did mother know? <clears throat> oh, oh, she knew. The two of them may be promised to keep his cave shut. They asked me to seal it myself and not tell a soul. They said we should forget about this cave. <clears throat> You'll see in a second. 
Spaggy boy, would you mind leaving the two of us alone? Yes. That's what she said. Nanaki, I want you to continue your journey with Spiky Boy and the others. Grandpa? Listen, Nanaki. Spiky Boy says they're trying to save the planet. Honestly, I don't think it can be done. For if they stop every act on the planet, it's only going to postpone the inevitable. Even if they stop Sephiroth, everything will perish. Oh, yeah, why don't they use a soft on him? Like, we have softs, they're in my inventory. But Nanaki, I've been thinking lately. I've been thinking if there was anything we could do as part of the planet, something to help the planet is already in misery. No matter what happens, isn't it important to try? Or am I just wishing against fate? It's here I'll be 130. That's why Nanaki must go with them, for my sake. Grandpa. Yeah, a soft would cure him. He'd be fine. 130 is the new 30. Yay. Wait. I, ho, ho, ho. I'm sorry. I didn't say ho, ho. So glad that you came back while I was alive to show you. Grandpa, don't talk like that. I don't want to think of life without you. Ho, ho, ho. Well, I've had a long life. Grandpa, you must live. Mr. Enzo CZ, thank you for the follow. I'll see to it. I'll see what's happening in the planet and I'll come back to tell you. No, we didn't even get Arius level two when it break. Nanaki. I am Nanaki of Cosmo Canyon, the son of the warrior Seto. I'll come back a warrior true to that of a noble name, so please, Grandpa. Look, he's crying. Tears. L -l 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 little tears and shit. That Seto's Seto. Seto. F Father. Father. Nothing like the tears of a puppy. Pokemon with the new. Maybe take the arrows out of him? I don't know. Pretty sure I wouldn't want to be standing there with a bunch of freaking arrows shoved in me. Nah, we'll just leave him here. He's fine. They said they finished fixing the buggy. I <laughs> joke when I tell the but it's terrible. <laughs> now you just go to the pound, right? Shall we get going? So this is it, Greg. That's just the way it goes. You came in handy at times. Except for when you pooped on the rug. His name is Kyle. Why is Bear not cussing? Because it's 1997. And we bleeped out all the bad words. Doop -de doop -de doop. Wait a minute, I'm coming too. Hmm? Oh, yeah. Spiky boy, please, look after Nanaki. What happened? I think I grew up a little. That's what happened. I never really picked a voice for Nanaki, so we're doing, like, just deeper version of my talking voice. Well, that cave was um, not nearly as hard as I expected it to be. Onichan? 
In Germany it does? Of course in Germany it does. Everybody swears in Germany. Milk is the fastest liquid known to man? Oh no. Pasteurize before you even see it. Good lord. Nice to Aerith for a minute. I will be nice to Aerith. Have a good one, Hair. Love you, brother. Good to see you. That's the sound a buggy makes. We're in Nibble area. Vincent area. We could try and get him. I don't know how well that's going to go. What? This was all supposed to be burnt down, right? I thought so. Then why? My house is still here, too. The hell's going on? This a dream or something? What are you fighting fires in Louisiana? Oh, jeez. Can I actually get Mitsuri without Materia? Or Vincent without Materia? I think so. I think if I use items that use magic, Cajun, oh my gosh. <laughs> That's terrible. This is the end. Sir, don't say such awful things. How does Barry know? That's a good question. Does Barry pay the fool? I play the fool, don't know. Excuse me, his name's Kyle. <laughs> Oh man, I don't know if I can get any items that do what I want them to do. Alright. Let's sell this materia. Sell that. <sighs> sell that. Classic TV2. Absolutely. This is a 36 inch Sony Trinitron. A man in a black cape? It's tattooed the number 12. He's holding something. Ooh, an elixir. Can you hear the voice of Sephiroth? I'd like to talk to you about your car's extended warranty. Level 3 Hoarder on Magic. I want to hear your story. I lived in this house since until I was 14. No, this town was burned down. Uh, the first time you fight Genova is on the ship. On, on the boat from Junin. Yo, John Blaine, thank you for the follow. It's Tifa's house. Must get it and bring to Sephiroth and become one with Sephiroth. Nope. All you can fight in here is um the monster in the basement. And then you go to Nibble Mountains and you fight the Materia Keeper. Nope. You fight Genova. Oh yeah, you do fight Genova in the mountains. No, you fight Genova in the north. In the north, uh, north crater. You fight Genova on the boat. You fight Genova at the end of disc one. You fight her at the northern crater. And then you fight her at the end of the game. Best RPG of all time. I agree. John Blaine, welcome in. Reunion. And.
Luxor's ooh. I love the remake, Twisted Logic. I love the remake. I don't think it's as good as this, but I still loved it. Alright. If you guys could hang out for a second, I'm going to take a quick break. I got to use the bathroom real bad. I will be right back. Enjoy the music. I didn't even turn it up for you. Come back. Oh, sorry about that, guys. When you got a P, you got a P. Zenyuri, thank you for the follow. I actually have the mobile for this, and I like it a lot. Remake's good, just want to go to Mega Art, yeah. Sorry to scroll up there quick. Don't want to miss anything in chat. Wee! What do you think? Should we try and get Vincent? Oh, he's calling. Sephiroth is calling. Mine plus, baby. The great Sephiroth is near. Inside the mansion, the great Sephiroth. Oh. The lid of the box, the most oxygen. Yo, thank you for the follow, Zaniri. Behind the ivory is short of tea and ray, so that's the piano. So it's the box, the piano. I'm creaking the floor near the chair. Left five steps, up nine steps, left two steps, up six steps. Right 97. I gotta write this shit down. Hold on a second. Do I have a pen? <laughs> So the first clue, I can never remember what this is. So thank you for the likes, guys. Thank y'all for being here. I appreciate you. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to figure out. If I want to cheat, I mean, it's not like I'm missing anything. I've done this a million times. What is the what is the combo? I don't really feel like looking for it again. It's 
It's not like it was my first playthrough and I'm missing out. Combo. Anybody. Thirty six ten fifty nine ninety seven. So right, left, right, right. All right, that makes life a hell of a lot easier. Thank you. I even make my three actually look at three. So we 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 wrote this on a uh, on a box of screws. I know it's like very illegible. My handwriting is atrocious, and I'm also writing on a box of screws. Same here, on MG. This is like, this is probably my 21st playthrough. I, I, I estimated. I played this game almost once a year, every year since it's come out, or since I played it the first time. Oh my gosh! Just die. Saw the movie Legend of it. Oh, jeez. Oh yeah, we don't need to do this. We don't need this shit. We're just gonna go do the thing. Where is it? I forget. Twin Viper, that's a weapon for Sid. Can't get in there. Don't really feel like fighting these. <clears throat> oh no, oh this is bad. Hey, take it easy, Twisted. Thanks for popping in. I, I'm streaming like twice a week on this. No real set time, just when I feel like it. Where is the safe? Must be on the second floor. I know it is on the second floor, off to the left-hand side, I believe. Oh my gosh, the freaking battle! Oh yeah. A merman, dad, a merman, right? A mer person. I don't understand this enemy. I never understood what they were trying to do with this enemy. It made no sense to me. Oh, Zoolander. I've only ever seen Zoolander like once. Blade Beam, we got it. We got Blade Beam. Amazing. Ah, oh, there's no fun there. Alright, I gotta look. So it's... Right 36, left 10, right 59, right 97. 36, 10, 59, 97. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's right. Shit, you gotta do that. You have to hit circle on the buttons. I always forget that. Oh, I need my light. I can't see the numbers. All right. Shit.
First try. Oh yeah. MF6 had some messed up uh, mechanics. Oh fuck me. This might not be happening right now. Anyone want to look up how much health this thing has? Missing, uh, missing number. Seven thousand? Oh, that's not. It's like your phone's listening to us. Uh-oh. There it is. Oh, for fuck's sake, dude. We're in physical form now. That's what I wanted. For the magic form. Wait. Yeah, okay, we went. Good guy. I forgot how fucking fast he was. Lost number, yeah, that's the one. Guys, I think I screwed up. I should have gone with the magic one. I think we're fucked. <laughs> oh, for crying out loud! Come on, you motherfucker! Ah, uh, we're stuck in a feedback loop. Jesus Christ! <laughs> that was rough. Yeah, we're going to try and uh, do it the other way. He did double attack me. He, he totally got two attacks off.
shit, I didn't save before I went in there. Wait, is he not? Who has that? Oh, we died. Uh. That's right, I forgot to give Barrett back his armor. No wonder he was taking damage so bad. Yeah, we died to uh, lost number. We're gonna give this another shot. If it doesn't work this time, we're probably not gonna be able to do it. Damn, that was rough. Let's. Oh, that's bio. He can be poisoned, can't he? I believe he can be poisoned. You always remember says Kyle? Well, Barrett's Kyle. That's funny. That's funny. So that's the end. <laughs> Meh, never gonna use that. Maybe we get there. Boy, this is going to be tough. So what happened is the town did get burnt down and these are all Shinra employees. Alright, so we're going to collect all these items again. Oh, yeah. Oh, that special material that I'm not allowed to use. I think there's a black cape dude in here that gives you an item, too. Yeah, he gives you a luck source. Where's one upstairs? Nope, I always thought there was. He can be paralyzed. Maybe we should go back to cross slash. Oh, we don't have the other thing yet. Okay. I forgot that happened in the mansion. See, we'll still do a cross slash. Nice thing about the level one limit breaks is they charge faster. Substantial magic power? Nah. You don't need that. Oh, 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 that's a weapon for Tifa that's worse than what I already have. Oh, it's the double material one, the double growth. Well, that's worthless. Can we go through Tifa's things again? Yeah, ruby weapon's gonna be impossible. Alright, you know what I'm gonna do is go out here and save. Pog plays. So I don't have to run as far if I die again.
Oh, yeah, Ruby can be paralyzed. Oh, Dazers. I didn't think about that. Wait, don't Dazers confuse? This isn't a speed run. This is a no materia run. We're using absolutely no materia. What did I want to do here? I don't know why I opened the menu. Oh, I know what I wanted to do. I remember. Oh, there's a weapon for Barrett. Eh. Wait, why is he in the back row? Alright. I gotta turn my light again. My apologies. 36, 10, 59, 97. Got it. First try. You guys ready for this? Bear in the background defend. Problem is we need to deal as much physical damage as possible. Of course if I defend, wait. We still get limit breaks. Oh shit, I used a phoenix down. What the fuck was I thinking? We got this far. Okay, he's frozen. That did not last very long. All right, we got we got a strategy now. We're going to freeze him again. That's okay. Why did he turn into this one? And why did I just heal him? Fuck.
damn it, motherfucker! This boss fight sucks. Now wait, why did he turn into the physical form? Is it because I was using items before too? Uh, we're struggling. He should have turned into the magic form, right? I feel like I need to look this up, but I'm kind of confused now. Yeah, give me give me a little synopsis. Yeah, how's everybody doing tonight? Welcome on in. beating that thing without materia and our weak ass items. I think if we poison him. Paris said he was a good game. I don't know how I I don't know how he makes gonna tackle this place. I've wondered that. Poison works? Alright, we gotta poison him. This is disc one. First time you come to Nibbleheim. Let's grind a bit for it. We could grind a bit. We. Yeah, we could go get Yuffie. Let's do that. Tag with poison, it keeps them in the same form. Really? I did not know that. Shit, that was Barrow, wasn't it? I think what we need to do is make sure we have limit breaks up, too. Yo, let's try that. If he stays in the same... If he stays in the same... Physical trap... What about items, though? That's the part I'm confused about. Because I used all magical items the first time. Item is still technically a physical attack. Shit. Yo, Sprinkle, thank you for the follow. So I think the goal is to try and poison him. See that holds water? Yeah, I've never heard that one before, that he that he stays, that he keeps his, like, thing. Where's that blade beam? Thank you for the lights, guys. Thanks for hanging out. 
Oh, those devil things suck. Ah, shit. Ouch! Might as okay. Cause I'm using like the Molotov, which is fire. Or maybe you know what? Maybe Molotov is physical. I didn't think about that. I wonder where we can actually get some magical items. I don't think there's anywhere, like, at this point that we can, really. Let's... Oh, yeah, we're gonna get limit up. We're gonna get limits up before we get in there. Let's go back to Kazuo Canyon and see if we can find some magic items. That explains a lot, though, because the Molotov didn't do much damage in his physical form, and it should be fire damage. It's Big Bird. But he's angry. Oh, okay. Because Molotov looks like fire. Yeah, Mol Molotov cocktail looks like fire one. Oh, very well, Mike. I don't know. We'll find out. We'll, we'll, I have a bunch. We'll use them. We'll use one. Let's get a fight. No, that's straight up regular fire. All right, Rage Bomber. Eat that. Eat that, punk. No, I tried that the first time through and he still turned into the physical form. I want to see if there's any one person or a thousand. Oh, I agree. I agree. We're going to do that. I'm going to check here for items, see if there's any magical items we can buy. Yep. No materia. That's very true. OP Gundam fan, welcome in. Yes, no materia. We're currently trying to beat Lost Number with no materia. That's kind of tough. I don't want to drink, sir. I want to buy your items. I want to buy your wares. Thank you. These are all shelves I got from Target. <laughs> I had to very heavily reinforce this shelf to hold this freaking 300 pound TV. I have an item that does Bio 3. Or Bio 2. WHW, thank you for the follow... 867530 no follow the that's a great name nice speak lurk <laughs> speak is lurking in the shadows where the hell's the item shop in here i never spent much time here that's later on 
Civil. Where is the real Cloud? I don't know, I never met him. It really does, Thoracane. Let's see. Gonna have to wait, absolutely. Yep. Oh, I know. I know how it works. You guys are wondering why I just sold my material. We are doing a no material run. I don't know. I've smoked since then. <laughs> very, very, very fair. Except for the one be you have showed. I don't think there's any more item shops in here. It's like they don't want to give me items to do things. They're like, meh, you'll figure it out. Well, I guess fuck us then. Nope, I didn't get Yuffie. Well, I guess we're just shit out of luck. That's very true. That's why it's a challenge run. Oh yeah, not hidden. Joey, I've played this game over 20 times, man. <laughs> yep, there's the uh, emerald weapon underwater. There's ruby weapon in the desert. I just got out of the buggy on accident. Yeah, thank you for all the likes, fellas and ladies. Oh my gosh, I didn't even think about that, Hammy. The Gelnika. Yeah, I bet that's a nightmare. I'm not... I can't get a Chocobo. I have no Materia. You can't get a Chocobo without Materia. Everybody just gonna miss? Guess so. I did not. I ran by him actually. Um, I there's a way to run by him without getting a chocobo or fighting him. Rocket Bear, welcome in, buddy. Hello, party people. Yeah, we ran by him. That snake didn't know it hit him. I've never heard of that one before, Civil. Rocket Bear, how you doing? Thank you for the likes, my friend. 10,000 needles. That was in Final Fantasy VIII. In Final Fantasy VII, it was only 1,000 needles. No, we're not quite there, Hammy. Yeah, you missed the giant swamp snake. We ran right by him. We're all the way past Cosmo Canyon now. Oh, I didn't think about that.
We're just doing a little grinding before we fight Lost Number again. Huh, interesting. I did not know that, Joey. No material run, fuck that, yeah. <laughs> it's been rough. We're trying to get Vincent now. Thank you for the likes. Actually, I think we decided I'm going to do Chrono Trigger next, because I've never actually beaten Chrono Trigger. What's our health like? Alright, we'll do, we'll do a little bit more. A little bit more grinding. I do have a Twitch. Uh, Retro Set Joe on Twitch. In fact, I'm Retro Set Joe on Twitch, YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, here, everywhere. You can stop last number with Cloud's um, Clem Hazard as well. I am I'm literally everywhere. I also have a Discord, y'all. If you if you go to there's an official website it's uh, retrosetjoe.com. We have a Discord community. You guys are more than welcome to join. Hang out with me there when I'm not streaming. You can find it from my Twitch page or you can find it from other stuff. I am totally in your house. Well, I'd love to use the hidden 7,777 damage trick. There's one problem with that. None of my characters have that much health yet. <laughs> I need an adult! Nicholas! Welcome in. Welcome back. Good to see you. We one shot a GI in a talk, the bot the ghost boss in, in the cave. He got Phoenix down to death. So we're in Nibelheim now. We're trying to we're trying to beat Lost Number. We're gonna grind up a couple levels. Because he's already uh, annihilated us twice. He slapped the taste out of our mouths. Dude, whatever weapon Barrett has misses fucking everything. Well, good thing that magic bear isn't going to keep you from getting stabbed. Barrett's mad now. Stop playing fool! That did not kill that thing. Same here, mouthpiece. Love this game. Thank you for the follow. No materia at all. Uh, long range weapons don't do that. Oh, it's because it miss. It might miss more because she's in the back. Or I didn't think about that. I didn't think about that, Josh. Hey. You're welcome to the entertainment. Thanks for being here. Oh, we got nuts. These nuts. Kingdom Hearts, nice. Mr. Cheeks, thank you for the follow. Final Fantasy 1 is the best one. I like Final Fantasy 1. It's a great game. This is still my favorite. It is an intense mission. We've made it this far, though. We haven't used a single material for anything. In fact, I've been selling them as soon as I get them. We're on disc one. We just got through um, Cosmo Canyon for the first time.
But we're gonna try and get Vincent early. Level 50, then walk out the disc, right? <coughs> We've made it this far, Mr. Cheeks. Taurus, hey, how you doing, bud? Welcome back. I believe Taurus is the reason that we're doing this. He was the first one to say, hey, you should do a no material run. Thank you for all the likes. There is a damage overflow glitch with uh, Vincent's weapon. You have to kill a shit ton of enemies with him, though. Dark matter, pretty much. I've never actually done the the uh, the overflow glitch myself. There's one for him and there's one for uh, Barrett. <laughs> but Barrett's requires you to master Knights of the Round like what two, four, six, eight, ten. I think fourteen times. Uh, we got him to halfway health twice. He he transformed both times, and then he just slapped the ass off of us. It was not pretty. This is the content I'm here for. Awesome. I'm so glad that I've managed to stumble onto Retro Gamer and Final Fantasy 7 TikTok. Y'all are wonderful. Vincent's glitch, um, Vincent's death penalty weapon gets more powerful uh, the more enemies he kills. So eventually you can kill so many enemies with him that it overflows. And it does negative damage, which confuses the game and it just kills anything. Cloud's ultimate weapon's power is based on his current health. Uh, Tifa's... I can't remember. Yes, Frosty Brooks, welcome back. You found the FF Live. Maybe consider following this time. You'll know when I go live. Not telling you what to do or anything. But totally telling you what to do. <laughs> Yo, Seamer666, thank you for the follow. Howdy, Mr. Mr. M. Plex. Welcome back. Is your kind of live? Awesome. Hold on. Barrett, oh, Barrett was, you know what? Barrett shouldn't be in the front row. I've moved him back. Advent Cheese, thank you for the follow. Wee! We're going to go ahead and heal everybody. Yo, Mataroni, thank you for the follow. Yes, I do remember you. Oh yeah, I remember you. I remember your name from before Frosty. I remember you being here. My favorite character in this game is Zack. Um the 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 kind of secret character who's like mysterious. I think for the Rose and the Fire. Uh my favorite playable character though is probably Sig. Zack is the Zack is the most like heroic and just badass character in this entire story of Final Fantasy VII. I have played Final Fantasy Remake. Yeah, like the playable one in Crisis Core. You got it. Zack is such a good character. And if you've ever had a chance, guys, if you I'm telling you, there's an anime that came out with the Final Fantasy VII compendium called Last Order. If you ever get a chance, watch it. It's the story between... Um, it's the story going up to Final Fantasy VII, but it's an anime form. It's like a half hour long. And it is beautiful. 
it is beautiful. So it, it touches on uh, Zack and Cloud. It's called Final Fantasy VII Lost Order. Or Last Order. Last Order. Final Fantasy VII Last Order. Not Lost Order. Last Order. It follows two timelines. It's after Zack and Cloud get captured in, in Nibelheim. And it's before they get captured in Nibelheim. They did. It's called Crisis Core. Oh my, OMG. Yo, Joey MJ, thank you for the follow. Yeah, it's a third-person shooter. It's freaking hard. That game is tough as shit. Yes, PS2. I have it, actually. So we're trying to get Tifa a little more health, and then we're going to go in and slap the shit out of this thing. Uh. Prove it. Oh god, I gotta. F I'd have to find it. All time favorite. Hey, Joey. Well, welcome in. Welcome to Final Fantasy VII TikTok. Is my favorite game as well. Tifa, why aren't you leveling up? Good lord. In fact, I had two copies of this, and I gave one to my buddy Steve, who came over and ran a really, really long Ethernet cable for me. You looked it up. Did you look up Lost Order? Dude, Lost Order is like 30 minutes. My, it's probably the, my favorite like 30 minutes of anime ever drawn and written. It's so good. Go to the menu. I will hear in a second. Nice. PSP with Crisis Core. That's pretty badass. Same here, Mouthpiece. I love the storyline. I think it's really cool that they're making it fresh. Dude, that battle with Sephiroth. Oh, man. It was so good. In fact, I think the battle with Rufus was harder, but all of it was a just nightmare. Uh, Tifa is fine. They changed quite a bit. They kept it pretty similar until you get to about the Shinra building, and then everything changes. I love the battle system. I know a lot of people wanted turn-based only, but... I'm sorry, it's it's 2021. That's not gonna fly these days. You installed it yesterday. Do it, gaming ramen, Ramon. Oh yeah, I know. She's like, she's over halfway to the next level. We'll get her there. This is the historian of gaming. Yes. It is short. Your high don't mind you. It's all good. I can neither confirm nor deny that fact for myself. Such strength and wisdom, I can hear it. I mean, I do love history of gaming. I'm a, I'm a huge, huge fan of gaming. Oh my gosh. Missed that game? Well, there you are. Here, here it is. Here it is. Yo, Gaming Ramon, thank you for the follow. I'm the historian of gaming! Yes, yes. This is my all-time favorite game. FF7's my all-time favorite game. Which is why I'm playing through it here probably for like the 21st time. The undead boss. 
I killed him with a I killed him with a Phoenix. Yes, there's an Android and iPhone version of this game that are actually really decent. Yo, Focus, thank you for the follow. FF7 and 9 are T, that's fine. And Ty, Jersey Devil. I still need to play that. Oh my god, Tifa, just fucking go already. We. We. Is a good game. It just isn't my favorite. Tifa doesn't want to be a sub. Tifa's definitely a top. Nice. Oh no, Chef, that's terrible. I've played seven more than eight and nine combined, but I do like eight and nine. I like I like the PS1 era of Final Fantasy games. They were all good. And Final Fantasy 6. Or 3, as it was in America. Oh, Tiffy, you're almost there. Come on, dude. Come on, man. Barrett leveled up. And... 6 is a great game. See, the thing is, though, like, 9 might have been... Yeah, 9 had a great storyline. I'm using a PS2 B-Rad Rocks. PlayStation 2. Oh, really, Tim? Thank you for the follow. I'd have to agree with you there, Mouthpiece. Oh, all FF good is... All FF games are good. It's just some of them are better than other ones. Thank God, Tifa finally freaking leveled up. All right. Blitzball? Was it Blitzball? <coughs> I've never actually played Final Fantasy XII very much. I played, like, the intro to it. And I didn't like the fighting style, so I really didn't play it. All right. Let's get some items. And save. We gotta save. No one Mega Man? Yes! So I have Mega Man Legends 1 and 2. Mega Man 8's right there. It's Mega Man X, Mega Man and Bass on the Super Nintendo. That is a repro. I have Mega Man X 4, 5, and 6 right here. I've got Mega Man X 7 in my PS2 games. I've got X um, Command Mission and Mega Man 4. Uh, 11 and 14 are the online ones. 12 wasn't online. 12 was the one with Balthier and um, Va uh, Vane and all those other characters I can't remember the names of. Yeah, 11, 11 and 14 were online. It's all good. It's all good. It's alright. Okay. All right, we're gonna give this. We're gonna give Lost Number another shot here. I am going to. Uh, I've never played Breath of Fire. I'll BRB here in a second. Um, I gotta go uh, water the grass. I'll be right back. Hang tight.
back, I'm back. All right, let's see what I miss. What I miss. Weird time of the day to water the grass. Yes. Game had the squares. That was a Legend of Dragon. Okay, we're back. I love to hear with all the crazy people. Bailey, we are still doing No Materia. This is the No Materia run. Oh, really? Hey, I know. Dude, the music in this game all together is just so good. Alright, we gotta turn the light on. God, that's so bright. Okay, there we go. I like Looks FF15 too. It's a very pretty game. Alright, I gotta look at the numbers. Xeno Gears. Oh, that could be. 36, 10, 59, 97. Easy peasy. Oh, man. Oh, this is going to be rough. We're going to try and get Vincent. We're using no materia, though. This fight is tough. With no materia. <laughs> Fucking shit, he one-shotted her. God damn it. Whoa! That did an ass ton of, of damage. A racing game with Bomberman. Dude, I love Bomberman, but I don't remember a Bomberman racing game. Dude, he's such an asshole. You're gonna chill the fuck out. Yeah, I realize. I just realized I came into this fight weak. Alright, we got a little bit of time to make up here. We'll be okay. We got this. I have a strategy. Yes, he's poison. All right. I did name Barrett Kyle. Favorite drinks are monsters. <laughs> oh, yeah. What a soundtrack. Fucking got him. 
I think we should have just poisoned him in the first place. We would have been fine had we done that. Wow. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. No materia, lost number. Thank you, thank you. Golf clap. Do you play uh, OMG? I'm also a musician. Oh, I'll be fine, Baileys. But yes, do, do metal covers. Empty bladder helps me climb the ladder. <laughs> oh no. You're watching a master work. Hey, it went well. It, it's. Yo, Serbaderp, thank you for the follow. I love your name. We're gonna go save now, now that we whooped that thing's ass. Jody935, thank you for the follow. Remember, if you follow me. Your rhythm guitar is nice. I play guitar, I play bass. I pretend to know how to play drums, and I sing. Cerberus, awesome. I actually, so I bought my multi-disc version of this off Facebook Marketplace. Look there. Do we get a save after? Dude, I am a constant saver. Bedtime. Hey, take it easy, Taurus. Thanks for popping in. Always good to see you. Silver megaphone. Not gonna be using that. How often do I play? Um, like music, often. I practice all the time. But uh, this, I've been streaming this like twice a week. It's been like Wednesdays and Sundays, but I don't have a set schedule right now. I'm kind of taking a break from Twitch. The SPLTD SC. Nice. I've got a few guitars. Uh, mostly basses. If I do acoustic stuff, I'll actually be doing an acoustic set tomorrow. If I think about it, I might even stream it to y'all. Recording literally every item you found. Nothing wrong with that. The B Rad Rocks, thank you for the follow. But yeah, tomorrow night I'll be playing a gig at a local venue. Maybe I'll maybe I'll live stream that. I won't be able to talk with chat because I'll be entertaining a live audience, but. Stop missing! Golden Saucer, Nintendo, Nintendo Land. I love that name too. Golden Saucer. Golden Saucer. Golden Nugget. Golden Nugget. This isn't Pokemon. Oh my god. The freaking fights in this. There's so many. All the enemies in this mansion suck. Needs Mindy? Well, hello, hello, Mindy. Welcome. 50 hours of chocobo races? I mean, that's easy to do. You know what the best part about Final Fantasy VIII and IX were? The fucking card games. Triple Triad. Oh my gosh. I spent so many hours on that shit. Yup. About to get Vincent, y'all. Oh, look, it's Zubat. You hate FF8. I'm not a huge fan of FF8. I like the card game, though. How many runs you got? Uh, this is like 21. But this is the first time I've done no materia. Oh. 
I think FF8 suffered from really bad localization. The characters had like no personality. That's a fair opinion to have. I'd say FF9 is almost as good as FF7. FF8, nah, not even close. What do you call a cheap circumcision? Painful. <laughs> a ripoff! Ouch! Oh, that hurts just thinking about it. Oh. No, Daily Drive Camp, thank you for the follow. That, oh gosh, oh. Like, I like, I don't know, I like a game with a strong female lead. FF8 was not that game. Seven Rings is King, agreed, Nicholas. To wake me from the nightmare. Who is it? Should we, we're gonna give Vincent like a Batman voice. How's that sound? Never seen you before. You must leave. You were having a nightmare. I woke you up. You ought to be thanking me. Hmm. A nightmare. My old sleep is giving me time to atone. What are you saying? I have nothing to say to strangers. Get out. This mansion is the beginning of your nightmare. Where's Harvey? You can say that again. Keith Davies' voice? Oh my gosh. Uh, you mean Keith Davis like Spawn? What do you know? Talk about Sephiroth. Like you said, this mansion is the beginning of a nightmare. No, it's not a dream. It's for real. Because I don't know what else to do. He, he's always been like Mr. T to me. He pays the fool. Sephiroth's lost his mind. He found the secrets hidden in this mansion. Sephiroth? Yes, Spawn, Goliath from Gargoyles. That's right. I love Keith Davis. He's actually on TikTok, guys. Go find him. He did a thing the other day with a bunch of his voiceover characters. You're telling you his imaginative sound. <laughs> yes, I found him the other day too. I was so excited. You know Sephiroth? Yes, that video was so fucking good. I was so excited. I was waiting for Spawn. And, uh, Spawn was near the end of that video, and if he didn't do it, I was going to comment that, uh, I'd follow if he, if he did Spawn. Gargoyle, a Rocky impression. Hey, yo, Adrian. You know, sometimes you, sometimes you punch him, and you know, sometimes you don't. I don't know. I don't do a really good Stallone. I can do a pretty badass Duke Nukem, though. You fangirled hard? I mean, who didn't? I fangirled so hard. I'm, th I'm 33, and I was just like, ah! My grief counselor died the other day. <laughs> he was so good that I didn't even care. I love that. Hey, yo, well, maybe I'll fight the guy, or uh, maybe I won't. Duke Nukem's 10 out of 10. I'm gonna rip off your head and shit down your neck. He's taking me lives. But he's seeking the promised land. I don't know who's talking right now. Now it's your turn. We could do Duke as Vincent. I think that would be totally inappropriate. Sorry, I cannot speak. Hey, you lying white faced. Christopher Walken. Christopher Walken. I have tried to the only line that ever comes to me is the one in JoJo. You talk bad to my friend again, I'm gonna stab you in the face with a soldering iron. <laughs> Hearing your stories has added upon me yet another sin. More nightmares shall come to me now, more than I previously had. Alright, we're doing Vincent as Duke. Now, please leave. Asshole. Those alien bastards shot up my ride. Uh. 
It's time to kick ass and chew bubble gum. And I'm all out of go. Your face, your ass. What's the difference? <clears throat> hey, you can see my dick from here. Everybody's favorite movie. My favorite movie of all time. And this is always when people are just like, why? Uh, Mars Attacks is my favorite movie of all time. With, uh, it's got Jack Nicholson, Pimento, Tom Jones is the hero, Danny DeVito's in it, Michael J. Fox, uh, Doom. But yeah, Mars Attacks, my favorite movie of all time. Favorite pinball game, nice. Other protagonist with a twisted. Twisted story. Dude, Mars Attacks, favorite fucking movie of all times. I'll never get tired of watching that movie. That would be a badass pinball machine to have. Fifth Element, that's a good ass movie. You know, this is one my wife and I were talking about the other day. She has never seen The Departed. We're 30 something year old people and she's never seen The Departed. I'm like, that's one of the best fucking movies I've ever seen. <laughs> Do you notice how all my favorite movies have Jack Nicholson in there? I thought you were listening to the radio laying down with headphones in. <laughs> no. Dude, The Departed is such a good fucking movie. Mark Wahlberg, Leonardo DiCaprio, again, Jack Nicholson, that other guy. What a freaking... Anger Management, that's a great-ass movie. Oh, Hunchback of Notre Dame's fucked. That story's all messed up. I am down with that OMG. Sephiroth. Mm, being here brings back memories. How's your mother? She's good from F and my father. The original Joker. I mean, other than Cesar Romero. Are you going to participate in the reunion? I don't even know what a reunion is. Because his mom died when he was 14. And he never knew his dad. Genova will be at the reunion. Genova will join the reunion. Becoming a calamity from the skies, yes. Genova, a calamity from the skies? You mean she wasn't an ancient? I see. I think you have the right to participate, yes. Never knew your father? It's alright. He didn't deserve you. I will go north past Mountain Nibble. If you wish to find out, then follow. Right meow, Genova. Reunion. Clemmy from the skies. Oof! <coughs> How mad are you guys going to be that I just leave that materia there? I'm just going to do this. Never going to pick it up. It's just going to be there for the rest of the game. Fuck that man. Sell it for nothing. It's a destruct material. It won't be worth anything. What did Kermit the Frog say at his puppeteer's funeral? Mm, Kermit the Frog here. Looks like that guy's dead. Stupid bats. Absolutely. Yeah, you know, I was fortunate enough to know, you know, I've known my dad. Yo, Kralberg, I am totally kicking ass. 
I'm kicking all kinds of air. Kicking air all up in this bitch. Oh, wait, wait. Wait. Wait a fucking second. Pimento, thank you for the hearts, my love. I forgot to fucking... I forgot to talk to Vincent again. What if everybody seems sick, they're always coughing. Oh god, I hate this enemy. These enemies always remind me of those things from Ocarina of Time. The like creepy things that scream at you. Ow! Alright, fuck this enemy. It's taking way too long to die. Yang's happy. Yang's happy. You're still here. Who are you? At least tell us your name. I was with the Shinra Manufacturing Department in Administrative Research, otherwise known as the Turks. Yo, thank you, Pimento. All right, what are we naming Vincent, guys? We got to name Vincent. And no, I'm not naming him Duke. We'll just do a Duke voice for him. Walken, Vega, Kremit, Hojo, <laughs> Simon, Vincent Vega, oh my gosh, Sebastian, and a bed, hey, take it easy, Nintendo, Dracula, so many great ideas, anyone like anyone else's ideas better, Pikachu, oh man, Carlos, So many options. Vega wins. Alucard. Alucard was blonde, though. Pedro. I kind of like Pedro, I'm not going to lie. Vega ain't bad. We'll vote for Pedro Fett. Roxy? Nope, it won't work. Hellsinger? You don't just want to call him, like, Norman? McLovin. He totally looks like a Norman. McLovin? Alright, I want to see. I want to see uh, McLovin versus Pedro. What do y'all think? McLovin versus. Or do we want Norman? McLovin, we got it one and one. Both. I don't think both's an option. Two for Pedro. Pedro. Vote Pedro. Stand by your suggestion. I'm thinking it's gonna be in Pedro. Such a fitting name. Considering Vincent is a freaking French name. Vincent. Off. Vincent Vega. He does have Vincent Vega hair. 
We're gonna go, we're gonna go with Pedro on this one. And I mean, come on. My name's Pedro. <laughs> the Turks? Formerly of the Turks. I have no affiliation with Shinra now. And you? Spiky Boy, formerly of Soldier. You are also a Shinra. Then you know Lucrezia. Who? Lucrezia. The woman who gave birth to Sephiroth. Gave birth? Wasn't Genova Sephiroth's mother? That isn't completely wrong, but just a theory. He was born from a beautiful lady. That lady was Laura Croft. She was an assistant to Professor Gast of the Genova Project. Beautiful Lucrezia. A human experiment? There was no way to cancel the experiment. I couldn't stop her. Pedro. <laughs> saw him before the end of stream? We could do that. Stand the block, I just saw her! <laughs> that was my sin. I let the one I love, the one I respected most, face the worst. Man, that one you start sleeping in a box? Give me a break! He's like, peace out, motherfucker. Let me sleep. First on the radio, Sprite. That's more, I don't know, exciting voice. Shit! Did you just have a Duke Nukem voice? Probably! <laughs> you listen to KTIT, KTIT. Bring you the best, I mean the best, in radio entertainment. I'd have to work for Howard. Yeah, I can be a little vulgar. Wait. If I go with you, will I meet Heijo? Hojo, Heijo, Heijo. Don't know, but we're after him and Sephiroth, so I guess sooner or later. Read a voice of Duke Nukem. I can do that. Lucrezia. All right, I've decided to go with you. What? What? Being a former Turk, I maybe have helped you. Hey, Joe. Hey, Joe. Don't do experiments on your wife. All right, then. Skeletor is the voice of Sephiroth. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> he man <laughs> Oh god Oh my god I don't know if I can do it with a straight face <laughs> Fucking Skeletor I've been, I've been kinda of doing like a Back when I did the blind run, uh, Sephiroth had a very James sounding voice from Pokemon. James. The time is now. Welcome to my reunion. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here before we get another fight. That would be funny as shit. I'll give it a shot. I don't know if I can do it with a straight face. 
And we're gonna get out of here and save. Mento requested some music. I'll play some music for y'all. Oh my gosh, just fucking hit him. Cleveland from Family Guy. I don't know what he sounds like. I've never really watched a lot of Family Guy. Get me out of this stupid mansion. I'm gonna see if he's like, yeah, he's like, he woke up and chose to be a pendulum. All right, we're going to save. I'm going to play some music for y'all. Do a song. Frieza. Kakarot. I don't know if I can do Frieza. Oh, that's a tough one. Oh, shit. Okay. All right. All right. All right. I'm going to play a song for y'all. Hopefully it doesn't suck. Let me grab a guitar. Oh, guitar pick. Oh no, not intermittent. This is gonna be the uh, probably the end. Oh gosh. Mm. Ugh. I was not supposed 
close to you. Pretty baby, I shouldn't let you go. All right. I do have a heart for Brittany. Get to see me perform. Yes. Yes. Ah, oh, thanks for hanging out, guys. White boy dancing in the show. Oh, my gosh. Using the of this song, guys. It's fucking hilarious. Hashtag free Brittany all day. All day. All right. Well, thank you guys for hanging out. It's been a blast as always. This is actually my wife's guitar. Uh, it's an Ibanez, and it's a very thin-bodied guitar. I actually love this thing a lot. Come out to thank for the ruse. But yeah, I might. You know, what? I, I play tomorrow. If my phone's not dead by the end of the day, I might stream some uh, music for y'all because I have a gig. So yeah, we'll do that. And uh, until next time, bye bye See ya, Crazy Rican. Hey, Ivan, what's up, bud? See ya, buddy. I love the best day I can. You do the same. Good night, everybody.